Evre, this is Richard Solomon, and this will be a tutorial or demonstration on creating a six-word Jewish short story using LiveJournal.com. Now, according to a literary legend, the great novelist Ernest Hemingway was once challenged to write a short story using only six words. And thus he wrote this short story. For sale, baby shoes never worn. So my challenge to you, Judaic students and teachers, is to create your own short story or poem in six words related to a Judaic theme by using LiveJournal.com. So, how might you handle this challenge? Let's show you. Here is LiveJournal.com. And the first thing you do is to create your own personal account by clicking here. Let me show you my personal account. Here is my personal account, Richard D. Solomon's account. And all you do in the subject area is write a topic like six words on Shabbat or six words on Israel or six words on Yom Kippur. And in the editor section over here, you write your six words. Now, if you want to get more complicated, you can use the editor menu up here in bold-faced or uh, italicized. You can even link items to what you've written, or you can even insert images. And that is more complicated. After you are finished, you can place tags, and you could preview what you have uh, written by clicking on this preview st uh, word, and you could share it with the public, or share it just with friends, or do it privately, or customize this. And when you want to post it, you just click here to post what you have done. So let me give you a couple examples of what I've done. Okay, so here is my six-word short story on Jewish history. Okay, this is sort of a joke. Some of you may have seen this. From slavery to redemption, let's eat. And what I've done is I've also linked this to a Google document. You don't have to do that if you don't want to. And what I've also done is I have linked this to a, a YouTube video, which you just click on here and uh, you can listen to the YouTube video at your own pleasure. Let me show you another one I did. This is Judaism in six words. Personal, transcendent, hidden, transparent, meaningful guide. I also added a Google document here. Again, you don't have to do that. And I also added a YouTube. Maybe we'll play the YouTube for a moment uh, that I added to this. Uh, perhaps you can hear it. I'll make it a bit louder to see if you can hear it. May the one who makes peace in the high places make peace over us and over all of humanity as together we sing Amen. I chose this particular piece from uh, Debbie Friedman simply because I love her voice. So it is possible to go and create a six-word Judaic short story. And if you like, you can add pictures and video to it. 
All you need to do is go to livejournal.com and create an account. Best wishes and thank you for listening to this demonstration or tutorial.